What's up guys? We are back taking you guys on another adventure into TJ's journey. So this weekend has been really, really productive, y'all. We've been apartment shopping, reception, hunting, um, all that is really accomplished. Today, we're here on a Sunday, Sunday afternoon, just really relaxing. Look, we got the blanket out, you know, we in our, our chill lounge, you know, we, this is y'all, y'all really getting the full authentic side of us, you know, we, we giving y'all everything. So we just relaxing, watching some, some movies, some shows, and just enjoying us, you know. Um, I think also, too, we, we haven't really talked about um, us being married, right? Um, it's probably, I guess, news, but we are, we are actually married, you know, we got married on May 28th. Um, so we kind of just want to talk a little bit about that. Can kind of give you guys a little glimpse inside of like why we did it, you know, why we did it the way we did, um, some things that we went through together, um, personally, um, and just some things that you guys can look forward to, to, to see and what we have coming up. Um, so yeah, Taya, you want to just dive in and, and kind of, you know, share your piece, share what's on your mind, you know, talk about TJ and... Yes, I can. Yikes. So, um, what about? Okay. So, um, as I mentioned, we, we did get married on um, May 28th. Um, we got to show you some pictures too in this video. Stay tuned for that. Um, but yeah, I mean, it's really, I mean, really, we can probably just start off with that, you know, how that whole process was, you know, why we decided to just have a ceremony um, in the first place. Well, we both have big families and we, we do value family. Family is a big part of our lives. And it's really hard, you know, it's really hard to kind of include all, you know, all of our family, you know, um, just for this kind of like one event, kind of, um, I don't want to say sporadic event, like quick event, but like, you know, we, we knew that we wanted to be with each other, right? At the end of the day, that's, 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 that's what was going on. We wanted to be with each other at the end of the day. Um, so we say, you know what, let's just, let's just make this, let's just make it happen. Let's just be legally married. Um, just be legally married and you know the bible talks about um you know becoming one so you know we wanted to make sure we did it the right way um and you know that's just our decision we decided to get married right here right in the backyard here and i mean it was a great experience great experience um it was a really special day um her brother actually came down from iowa and um you know married us it was really cool getting to meet him for the first time and uh, meeting her her family in the dmv area for the second time and see some other family that I haven't seen on her side of family. So she got to meet a lot of my family as well too. And then you guys out there maybe, you know, one day in this situation, um, at the end of the day, you guys do what makes you happy um, and don't let anybody try to take that away from you guys, right? Um, there's gonna be a lot of noise, a lot of voices on the outside speaking into you guys' marriage or relationship and, you know, giving you guys advice on what you guys should do. But um, we always have this thing where we, we always go to the word first. What does the word say? And then we go from there and we look at what what works for us yeah we'll be moving in to our apartment in august as well so you know we we just are doing things we are we are busy this weekend we are we are accomplishing some things so um <laughs> yeah so that's where we are right now you know we're just we're excited anything else you want to add to that tan i'll be um, rambling y'all he so basically said everything i don't think i have much to say um yeah we are married now and we're we are gonna have a bigger reception and um we're still getting settled i'm may june july i'm three months in what? three months in uh just about well two months and some change but two months and some change yeah. and <laughs> and i'm excited i started working and everything and so yeah um yeah it's been a very fun ride that's all i have to say yes a ride he basically said that definitely been a ride yes yeah, definitely adjustments and getting to know somebody like every day it's like a, a weekly daily thing you know but that's that's the joy of marriage i'm learning you'll never fully know everything about you know your significant other you know um but it's been fun i have to say it's been fun i've been enjoying it i'm sure hopefully she's been enjoying it too and um so yeah you know so you guys you know take a look at our pictures and um you just check out our um our outing our um, bowling alley coming next yeah. so until then guys we'll see you guys later
guys, back at it again. Yep, yep, we are here. It is Saturday. We are here at Navy Mix. Um, yeah, we just thought we would kind of just give y'all a little update on how we're doing. Um, we made it through our first month since we being married. It's been phenomenal. It's been an adjustment for sure. Um, so we're just going to talk about maybe some highs and some lows about our first month of being married. Definitely a huge new chapter in both of our lives. Definitely uh, some big adjustments that we've had to make. But um, I love her. She loves me. And you know, you make it work. You make, you make it work. You, you adjust and you, you keep the road moving. So um, I just ask you, you can start with this all. We're going to start with some highs. Maybe some highs of uh, the first month in of being married. And get you know, some highs. Yes. My highs. I'm sorry also that it's really loud because the kids are just real loud. And um, you know, if you guys know what main event is, it's very loud, so I'm sorry if you can't hear us. But um, some highs are that um, finally me and DJ can be together in the same place. Because as most of you guys know, we were distant for a very long time. So like, it feels good to finally not work to be together and to finally close to him so that we can experience life together. That's probably my high. Um, we both work every day throughout the week, so I think the only time we really have together to like actually do things is on the weekends, so that was also my high, having the weekends to be able to do those things with him. Um, and then just even going through like things together, we're in the process of like buying a house, we want to buy a house, so that's been a lot, um, but once we get there it's going to be a high. Right now it's, it feels good to do things together and experience hard times together. Um, but we know, we believe we're going to get through it. Um, highs for me, so, well I guess highs and lows, highs and lows. So, uh, I'll just go, so for me I guess the highs is that, you know, we've been doing distance for a year and it's really cool just to come home and, and like see her, like physically get to hug her, get to touch her, with the boys, the students, FaceTime, the screen, so I'm really enjoying that. Um, and, as we get closer to the weekend, just knowing that I get to spend time with my wife and uh, I don't get to like block out time on you know on the weekend weekends on FaceTime or we're on the phone for like three hours. But now we can actually do things and experience life and do life together and learn and grow. So I'm, I'm loving that about it. Um, those I would say is kind of the same as you said about like just not having the time with each other during the week because we work like so much and right now our schedules aren't aligned. But um, you know, God's moving, he's moving, he's moving, he's making some, some adjustments for us. And so right now we're just we're patient and we're enduring during this time and we're enjoying it every, every little bit. Of it. So, um, yeah. so yeah, so um, yeah, so okay, you mentioned the house, right? We're looking to buy the house. So yes, I mean guys buying a house or even renting, um, it's it's it is a, it's a process. It really is a process and we trust that God is really making a way for us. Like sometimes things don't happen the way that you want it to want it to happen, the time you want it to, but you gotta understand that um, we're not on our time or on God's time. And God's time is perfect. Like there's no better time than this timing. So we're we're trusting that, you know, we're we're laughing, we're we're enjoying those moments that we have. Um, and because we know this is just, this is just a passing through point, you know, this is just a season of life that we're going through. But once God says it's time for us to move, then it's going to be time for us to move. But, you know, we're doing all, everything in our power to, to make that happen. So that's, that's all we can do. And while we're waiting, we're doing what we can. Yeah. But yes, that's basically everything. Um, right now we're about to fold, so stay tuned. Yeah, I'm going to bust her right now. Yeah, I'm going to be him. So stay tuned, we'll post more videos of us going. Yep. Alright, bye! Go DJ! And I That was not the talk to he was he trying to lie. <laughs> Yeah? I have to do it harder. Yeah. Get your aim 
got one more to go. One more to go. This one's tough. I don't know if she's gonna get this one.